I leave this recording with the knowledge that all good things they don't last forever. Harry, Harry, over here, mate. Uh, two more. One for me. One for Jeffrey. Oh, I'm good, Harry. It's a school night. Harry, will you please tell Jeff to stop being such a pussy? <laughs> Point taken, Harry. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, at the bar, your attention, please. Uh, would somebody here, any one of you, please tell this pussy to stop being such a Jeff? <laughs> Hello, lover. Don't do it. Oh, he clearly wants to communicate. Yeah, he's a dick. Just ignore him. Oh. Oi. Oi, princess. My mate here, he thinks you're a dick. I personally think he's just got a staring problem, so... Which is it? <laughs> what? He could be a perfectly nice, albeit slightly autistic chappy. You're autistic. You never know, Jeff. I mean, I don't not want to be rich. Oh, who doesn't, right? So look, here's what's gonna happen. You're gonna forget about all that small time day player stuff the chap's been flinging your way. You really wanna pay that curly head fuck 10% of your earnings? We're gonna bring you out to Vegas. I'm gonna put you up, first of all, you know, small time. We start small baby steps. Can't just pop onto the main stage at the Luxor. That's not how it works out there, no. I'm gonna put you in some dirty, grimy, dingy hotel. And I know what you're thinking. You're probably thinking, fuck off. I'm not sleeping in some semen on the sheets, cockroach infested hellhole. But it's all an illusion. So you should appreciate that, being a magician and all. I wish I never met you. Hey. Things could be different and I could stay here with you. Believe me, I would. Are you just saying that? Yeah? yeah? This is hard, man. This is hard. It's 50. 